Uh, it's loud, it's noisy, there's a lot of people. This is the premier shopping district in Beijing. It's also expected to be one of the central locations for a lot of people to gather when the Olympics do come around. What you won't see here, besides the Olympics, a lot of negative publicity. In fact, you can see the big screen right over there. They play basically Olympic news 24-7, but you'll never see anything negative other than probably proclaiming some of the protests as divisive that's going on around the world. So what is going on here? Well, most people are just buying Olympic gear, collecting items like that. The state controlled media does not talk about the negative stuff. And we are actually seeing some of the international media like CNN or whatever in your local hotel rooms or if you have satellite. A lot of that often, whenever a negative story about the Olympic sports relay shows up, well, it actually gets blocked. You see periods where things go black or they come back up and they go to black again. That's going on a lot. And here in China, a lot of the people who are even more informed than just the average citizen admit that the controversy makes the Olympics a complicated situation. Whether or not they support their country, whether or not they support freedom, trying to balance the two, here in China, at most, is very difficult and at the very least makes for interesting conversation among Chinese and expats here in Beijing.